Brain age. Concentration training. Good evening. Let's start devilish training. Devilish training. Sounds pretty tough, huh? Oh, really? Well, I assure you, it is tough. In fact, I have to become a bit devilish myself. To make it devilishly tricky. Are you ready? That's the spirit. All right. Let's get started with a great example of devilish training. Devilish calculations. These aren't your ordinary calculation problems, though. You'll see each problem displayed one after the other. And you have to write the answer to each one. But the task is not to write the answer to the problem currently being displayed. Instead, you're to write the answer to a problem that was displayed earlier. For one back, you write the answer that was displayed right before the current problem. Let me show you how it's done. All right, it's your turn now. Let's practice one back. Let's practice one back. Remember this answer. Write the answer to the previous problem. That was perfect. Now let's try it for real. The actual training lasts for five minutes. First, let's try one back. Devilish calculations. Start. Okay, that's the stuff. Keep it up. Last one. Perfect. You got 100% correct. How was your first round of devilish calculations? There's still a long way to go yet. The benefits of devilish training can best be seen if you do the full five minute sessions. So you should always try to see it through to the five minute mark. In devilish training, the level or difficulty is constantly adapting to match your ability. In devilish calculations, the level changes according to your score. If you get 85% or more, you'll go up a level. If you get around 75%, you'll stay at the same level. If you get 65% or less, you'll move down a level. In this way, your level changes as you continue to train in five minute sessions. I hope you'll give it your best. All right then, let's continue with devilish calculations. Your score this time was 100%. I think it might have been too easy for you. Let's make it more difficult. You scored 85% or more, which means you go up a level. Devilish calculations. Start. Great. Nice. That's it. Just one more. You didn't make a single mistake. You got 100% correct. 
you're good at fast one back. So, now it's time to try two back. You scored 85% or more, which means you go up a level. In two back, you need to recall what was asked two questions ago and write the answer. Let me show you how it's done. Now it's your turn. First, try practicing two back. Let's practice two back. Remember this answer. Write the answer from two problems back. How did you find two back? Okay then, back to training. Devilish calculations. Start. Okay. That's the stuff. Keep it up. Last one. Perfect. You got 100% correct. For your next attempt, you go up a level. Devilish calculations. Start. Great. Nice. That's it. Just one more. You didn't make a single mistake. You got 100% correct. Pretty good. You're clearly not being pushed hard enough. Let's try to make it more of a challenge. You scored 85% or more, which means you go up a level. Devilish calculations. Start. Okay. That's the stuff. Keep it up. Last one. Perfect. You got 100% correct. Huh. Still too easy. Well then, let's move you up a level. You scored 85% or more, which means you go up a level. Devilish calculations. Start. Great. Nice. That's it. Just one more. You didn't make a single mistake. You got 100% correct. You're really moving through the levels. Let's heat things up a little. You scored 85% or more, which means you go up a level. Devilish calculations. Start. 
Okay, that's the stuff. Keep it up. Last one. Perfect. You got 100% correct. That's three minutes now. Focus as hard as you can. Let's continue training. You scored 85% or more, which means you go up a level. Devilish calculations. Start. Great. Nice. That's it. Just one more. You didn't make a single mistake. You got 100% correct. For your next attempt, you go up a level. Devilish calculations. Start. Okay, that's the stuff. Keep it up. Last one. Perfect. You got 100% correct. For your next attempt, you go up a level. Devilish calculations. Start. Great. Nice. That's it. Just one more. You didn't make a single mistake. You got 100% correct. Whoop, you've gone over five minutes. Time flies when you're really focused. Let's leave it at that for today. Good work. What an amazing result for a first attempt. Oh! Devilish calculations is tough, right? I'm not sure you realize what you're getting into here. Devilish training is effective precisely because it's so tough. These intense five-minute training sessions will really challenge your working memory. Maybe you're wondering what working memory is. Working memory is an important aspect of brain function employed in carrying out tasks. And the implications of training your working memory? You may find it has certain benefits. Improved efficiency at work or study. Increased productivity at work. Stronger academic performance. And it doesn't stop there. You may find yourself becoming less susceptible to distractions and able to focus more on the important tasks at hand. Not to mention, you could even apply your improved concentration to housework or sports. So many potential benefits. Devilish training is a true test of concentration. And it's not just for grown-ups. I think it's great for kids, too. I hope you'll train vigilantly every day. In order to create your daily records, I need to know a few details about you. Select a face for yourself. Is this one okay? Is this name okay?
In which year were you born? Please write out the full year. Now, tell me your date of birth. Is all the information correct? One more thing. Go ahead and stamp the attendance sheet. Great work today. You'll find lots to do in this software in addition to devilish training. There are many other types of training. I hope you'll try them all out. Train your working memory with some devilish training. Devilish pairs. Let's begin on level two. Devilish pairs. Start. Ooh, luck, nice. That's it. Perfect. You got 100% correct. How was your first attempt at devilish pairs? Here's a review of the rules. Turn a card over and remember. If you turn a card over with the same number, you'll clear that pair of cards. If you guess incorrectly, that's the wrong answer. Your score is based on the number of matching pairs and non-matching pairs. Your level can go up or down depending on your score. In this way, the difficulty is adjusted just like in devilish calculations. Okay then, let's continue training. You scored 85% or more, which means you go up a level. Devilish pairs. Start. Ooh, nice, that's it. You didn't make a single mistake. You got 100% correct. Pretty good. You're clearly not being pushed hard enough. Let's try to make it more of a challenge. You scored 85% or more, which means you go up a level. Devilish pairs. Start. Ooh, look nice. That's it. Perfect. 100% correct. Huh, still too easy. Well then, let's move you up a level. You scored 85% or more, which means you go up a level. Devilish pairs. Start. Ooh, look, nice. That's it. You didn't make a single mistake. You got 100% correct. You're really moving through the levels. Let's heat things up a little. You scored 85% or more, which means you go up a level. Devilish pairs. Start. Ooh, nice. That's it. Perfect. You got 100% correct. For your next attempt, you go up a level. Devilish pairs. Start. Ooh, nice. That's it. You didn't make a single mistake. You got 100% correct. Your 
are already training at the highest level. So let's keep at it. You stay at the same level. Devilish Pears Start You seem to be at a standstill. Five minutes have already gone by. You really worked hard today. Good work. Let's put your score on the graph. Training grade. You move up a grade. You've reached grade D. Congratulations! Challenge the speed of your working memory with some supplemental training. Calculations times 20. Work on keeping your brain active with some brain training. Blockhead. Thank you. 
Give your brain a break with some relaxation mode. Thanks for playing.